everyone's aware, you know, based upon our statement, what uh, what decision we made today. It's uh, I can tell you, it's extremely disappointing for for me, uh, for Kyle, uh, for ownership, uh, for everybody in here, uh, because uh, we care a lot about Ruben, and uh, um, I can tell you that uh, you know it was a situation where we. Uh, we laid out some very specific ground rules for Ruben, uh, as we do for all our players. We had uh, a set of standards in place that the players were involved with in developing. In this case, uh, it was communicated ex exceptionally clear and um, you know to the point as to what we expected out of them. And, uh, unfortunately, you know what transpired yesterday. Um, this isn't a comment on what happened there because that would be mere speculation on our part it's more of a comment on him not living up to what we had communicated and uh, to the energy and the time that we've invested into him that doesn't mean we don't love him um, uh, we all do we care for him but we feel like it's in the best interest of our organization to uh, to move on at this point and uh, that's a very tough decision um, I want to be clear that this is an organizational decision this is uh, you know Kyle and I talked last night, we brought it to ownership, and we were all lockstep in the decision. Uh, it was not easy on anybody, and uh, with that, I'll open it up for some questions. By saying the standard, are, are you saying that you didn't want him associating with a certain person? Listen, I, Matt, I, I don't want to get you know into what the specifics of that, but I, I will say, um, you know, after the the events of, of the offseason. We were very clear with him and I think very fair. And uh, he understood exactly what that was. And, you know, uh, the, the, really, the really sad thing is he had shown some, um, you know, uh, of late in particular, he, had, he was really taking some very positive steps and maturing in a, in a really nice fashion. Unfortunately, in life, um, there's, there's consequences for your actions. And uh, when you show bad judgment, particularly after something's been communicated very clearly what the expectations are, there are consequences. And uh, I think one lesson I've, you know, I've learned being around this league for almost 30 years now in different capacities is that nobody is bigger than the team. And that's ultimately what this decision came down to for us. What kind of communication did you have with him yesterday, John? Um, unfortunately, I haven't. You know, I was uh, at dinner when, uh, when this all transpired. Uh, at that point, it was in the, the hands of the, the police department and uh, you know as of right now he's still not out and so I have yet to, to be, be able to speak to Ruben I will and uh, look forward to that like I said I care about the kid and uh, care about his future and uh, that's, that goes not only for me for everybody in there. When, when you drafted him